Okay, so a pattern that I've been noticing is with the parent function when I ask people about their relationship with their parent function, also called, you know, their second function, their auxiliary function, which I have all of them listed here if you're not familiar with, um, they will often describe it in sort of a negative way. It's kind of like um, described as, well, by me and by others as sort of a burden, like it's their cost to bear and it's getting in the way of the fun child function, the thing that they really want to do and just have a good time with. It's like, oh, but I have to be this person. I'm the one who has to do this. And I've also noticed a pattern with the parent function. It's got a bit of an attitude problem and that's rather arrogance in its expression because it sort of has the idea that they're better at this than anybody else. Um, and this is offset and humbled by the critic function, which I have here because um, I know it's commonly thought in the community that critic function is the way in which you are critical of others, but it's also a way that you are uh, critical of yourself, your inner critic. And um, when your parent function, your second function is out there telling you um, that you're the best, your critic function is tagging along and telling you why you are the worst. So kind of um, playing an interesting game there when the parent function gets a little bit too much on its high horse. So I have them all written down here and I'll go through them um, one by one. So ENTJ and ENFJ with NI parent, they think that like they are better than anyone else at knowing what is the ba best path to take. Like I know what I want, I know where my life is going, I am on the right path. But then NE, critic pops in to say like, well, have you really considered all of the options to pick the best one though? Is this path actually meaningful for you? Then ESTP, ENTP with TI critic thinks that no one thinks as carefully as they do. Everyone else just isn't even thinking in comparison. And then TE, tells them like, well, I don't really know enough though. Every, like, um, others could say that I'm wrong. So really, who am I? And then ESFP and ENFP, FI parents, I'm the only one who is actually authentic and real. Everyone else is just trying to look good. And then FE critic jumps in and says, yeah, but nobody likes you. Nobody likes when you're so real and authentic. Um, I have them on a different order here than I do on my computer. So it's taking me a second. ESFJ and ESTJ um, SI. I'm the only one who actually does what they're supposed to around here. I'm the only one doing their duty. But then SE says, yeah, but I'm kind of missing out on a lot of life. I'm missing out on so many amazing experiences. I'm, am I really living life? INFJ and ISFJ with FE. Um, no one else can keep the harmony in the group like I can. I'm the only one who isn't selfish and is giving to others. And then FI says but am I actually being true to myself and my values, always trying to please others and keep the peace? INTP and INFP, I'm the only one who's deep and is able to look at bigger meanings. Everyone else is super shallow. And then NI critic says, but I'm not actually going anywhere. I have all these um, ideas and insights, but a lot of them I can't even implement. ISTP and ISFP with SE. Um, I know the best way to do things. The way that I do things is the absolute best and the right way. And then SI says, yeah, but I really don't have enough experience to back up what I do. So why would anyone actually listen to me? 
than INTJ and ISTJ with TE. I have the best facts. No, um, but yes, actually it is like that. I am the most accomplished. I have the best system. I have the be I have a, like done the most research. I have the best facts. So everyone should listen to me. But then TI jumps in and says like, is this what I actually think though? Am I being precise and accurate? Do I really have the best facts? So you see, it's just like a system of checks and balances. So it's so important to have a good relationship with both of these functions so that you don't become too arrogant or think too little of yourself. So if you liked this, please like and subscribe to support this channel.